What up, guys? It's Arby, uh, Arby Bassangler, Adrian Marar here, and uh, it's my partner, Nick Dolick. Uh, we just won the 2019 Bass Fest on the California Delta. Uh, man, it feels good to be back out here. I haven't been out here in a month, and it's fun. So, uh, today we're pretty much just uh, stuck with the basics. You know, you only need five rods on the Delta if you know what you're doing, and I only use two. A <laughs> thank and a and uh, punch him. So we uh, we ran around doing that for the first half of the day and when it was a little bit uh, overcast outside. We threw a little bit of uh, Sankos around. I caught one good one on that. Broke another good one off. And uh, then later in the day when the sun came up, we went punting. Um, caught, caught a lot of small fish, like less than 12 inches, like real small. But then when we got the good bites, it was a good one. So we just... Uh, found the right clean grass. You wanted to make sure that grass was clean and it was isolated if you could find it. And uh, that's where those big ones were. Uh, yeah, so pretty much I was using a Phoenix Recon 2, uh, 796. Uh, we 65 pound braid, going straight to a river, to, uh, ounce and a half river to see uh, tungsten and a uh, ski bomb. And uh, just punching in the, the grass and the mat, depending on uh, the situation. And it worked out very well. Anything you want to add No, pretty much matched the same thing, except my setup was pretty much green pumpkin version of the, the same yeah. type of thing, you know, so, yep, I think it's just the consistency of having that confidence, having a good time, and just knowing that, yeah. you know, the fish yeah. will come, and that uh, was... That another was thing I want to mention is, like, when we were going down a mat, he was still, he, we were never doing the same thing, so, like, even if we were going down a mat, he would throw a Senko in the inside weed line on the outside weed line, and I'd be flipping the front. That way we had two different presentations going on at the same time, and contributed to one of the bigger fish in the boat. But when I hear him, I don't think I would have, I would have had my small fish would have been right around two pounds. But uh, that's how it goes out here. It's a winner and lose game, and uh, just today it happens uh, to be the lucky winner. So um, we got the belt. That's the key, the key thing around here. We uh, just good good event. I think everyone thinks yeah. it's a good time, and just to win one of these, you know, wrestling belts for bass is just. You know, an awesome accomplishment that we'll be able to remember forever, and yeah. it's a good time. Want to pull some fish out? Let the guys see some fish. Yeah, let's pull some. Ah, let's do it. Well, 